I made all your breakfast faves, my hunka hunka burning love. Tomorrow is Valentine's Day, the one time of year I get to make everyone as happy as we are. Mwah! First you eat, then you spread the love, my Cupid Cuddle Bomb. Oh, sorry, Eros. I know how much you hate being called Cupid. I don't mind it too much when you say it. Come on, give Cupid a kiss. What the? What is it? I want to get Atlanta something for Valentine's Day tomorrow. But what? Send your sweetheart a love balloonogram. Only three bucks. Oh, <laughs> I can't do that. Why? You need the three bucks? No! A love balloonogram is way too obvious. Yeah. You wouldn't want Atlanta to know you like her. Better to keep her guessing. <laughs> Fear of rejection is a serious thing. Millions suffer from it, and we don't appreciate your sarcasm. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing says I love you like 50 love balloonograms. <laughs> Sorry, only five per student? But that's not enough. Anymore, and Jay's gonna get scared. Uh, what makes you think they're for Jay? Love may be blind, Teresa, but I'm sure not. Well... Bring on the love. Ah, Eros and Psyche. Sorry to interrupt you both. I know how busy you are this time of year and all. But I was thinking we'd try something new for Valentine's Day. This year, you will spread my message of hate to New Olympia, especially to those annoying kids or you'll never see your beloved Psyche again. like a fat balding baby to you ah worked like a charm now go forth and spread hate my cherubic messenger of mean <laughs> Get down a notch, Harry. Sorry. Sometimes I don't know my own strength. <laughs> ah, Woohoo! The girls win! Oh, yeah! Hey, no fair! That's not a regulation net. We're not 
not going down without a fight! Bring it on, loser! What did you say? I said, bring it on! Whoa, what's that all about? Well, what are you waiting for, meathead? Give me the ball! Oops. Sorry. Sometimes I don't know my own strength. <laughs> Taste the liquid to turn smooth, not cloudy. I love me. I love me not. <laughs> like that's ever gonna happen. I love me. Oh, missed. Oh, my hair! It's awful. I am so. Neil? Neil? You in here? Huh. That's strange. Man, people have been acting crazy today. I broke up three fights just on the way here. Look out! Correction, people are still acting crazy. I'm out of here! What? Pig! Princess! That had my name on it! Your name is Banana Nut? Ugh! Give me that! Uh, uh. Hey! Back off! That does it! What's going on? <laughs> Harry? I can't live like this! I need my own space! Teresa? What? You're leaving? Oh, she's leaving too? Good! There'll finally be some quiet around here. What the heck is going on? Neil wouldn't shut up about his hair. So, I shut him up and took care of the problem for him. <laughs> Come on, guys. We're a team. We can't act like this. People need us. Whatever. I need more ice cream. Oh, hey, sure. Why doesn't everybody just leave and give up? Fine by me. Yeah, I'll bet Cronus would just love that. Hey, wait a second. I wonder. Come on, Neil. I've got a hunch Cronus is up to his old tricks again. Ow! Hmm. It does look a little off. It's obviously tainted. Looks like hate to me. You're looking at me because I'm ugly, aren't you? <laughs> Eros is your son, right? The god of love. Yes. Well, what if Cronus got to him? What better way to defeat us than to make us hate each other's guts? <laughs> hmm, you may be right. <laughs> and I bet my luxuriously wavy hair, Cronus is holding his wife's psyche hostage on a mountain somewhere. Those bad guys have, like, zero imagination. Comfy, my dear. I do wonder if Eros will return for you. It seems he's found a new passion. If Neil can hate himself this much, can you imagine what this spell is doing to normal people? We have to reverse the spell. Maybe Odie will be able to affect the brain's neurotransmitters involved in love. Forget neurotransmitters, honey. I am the goddess of love and beauty. If you need a love potion, just ask. And voila! Whoa. Glad I don't have to drink that. No one said love potions were pretty. I'll round up the others. 
if they'll answer. Come on, move that giant tank already! Ugh, you're such a baby! Carissa! Jay, this had better be good. Huh? What? You're trying to breach my new security system, huh? Good luck. I thought you were leaving. I did. And now... Harry! I'm back. Fine. Then Harry! I'm leaving. Don't slam the gate on the way out. Cody! Yeah, Cody! right. Uh, you might want to answer your radios. Archie! Atlanta! What are you doing here? What am I doing here? More like, what are you doing here? This is my special camping place. You're going to regret that. What was it you said earlier? Oh, right. Bring it on! No answer from Archie in Atlanta. My beautiful, precious hair. Gone! There, there. Aphrodite's here! But I loved my hair. Well, at least the antidote works. <laughs> That's terrible. I thought love was supposed to be sweet. Hey, I think it's working. Uh, he's not gonna fall in love with me now, is he? No. But would you like him to? I can arrange it. No! no! Okay, I'm in the satellite array. Good. You and Teresa are in charge of finding Eros while we find Psyche. Tiny problem? We have no idea what Eros looks like. Here. That's my baby Eros. Thanks. We're on it. I think I've got them. Aphrodite was right. Cronus has Psyche on Mount Olympia. Then let's go. Hey, what about Atlanta and Archie? <laughs> Come on, oink! Fight like a girl! You can't handle it, can you? <laughs> in the air. There he is. He's very inconspicuous. Arrow! Huh? And apparently he has the power to turn invisible. That'll make finding him easy. Hey, Neil. Sorry about shaving your head, man. Not as sorry as I am. I have a rep for great hair to maintain. Your rep is the least of our concerns. Look, there's Cronus. <sighs> Eros has failed me. Time to take matters into my own hands. <laughs> Since those kids are always poisoning my plans. <laughs> Let's change the plan. <laughs> Get out of the air! We can't win this up here! Roger that! Ah! 
Give up? Uh, not a chance. That's Jay Sword. What are we doing? We're helping our friends. Nice of you two to <gasps> drop in. I kind of like the way this turned out, don't you? Don't be so sure of yourself, Brodus. Guy, he may also be invisible. Huh? Watch where you're going, Buster. Me? Watch where I'm going? Please tell me you're having better luck than me. No, I sense he's close by, but I just can't pinpoint where he is. It's no use. We're never gonna find Eros. The guy can disappear. Even if we did, what are we gonna say? Hey, Eros, great news! Your wife is being held hostage on Mount Olympia by Cronus? Psyche? Hostage? <sighs> and even if you stop what you're doing now, you'll probably never see her again. Come on, we'll worry about what to say when we find him. <sighs> we'll need to work our way over there. There's no time. Come on. Oh, look, he wants to fight like a man. I am not a man, Jay. I am a god! Jay, he's hurt. He's yours. He won't stand a chance against you. I won't go as easy on him. Archie, look out! Foolish beast! Okay? Yeah.
no problem. Shaggy, you're safe. Eros, you're okay! <sighs> Is that necessary? Ew! Get a room, will ya? Jeez. Looks like Eros is back in business. So, like, maybe we could go for dinner? Are you hitting on me? No way, I'm hungry. What's the matter with you? A valentine? For me? Looks like yours truly has an admirer. Somebody must like my new look. Hey, wait a minute. We all got a valentine from a secret admirer. Okay, fess up. Who sent them? Eh, wasn't me. Who knows? Could have been anyone. Huh? Are these all from you? No, they're from all of us. To say thanks. <laughs>